Hey everyone, Technomancer here with a video for you guys on how to fix there is a billing problem with your previous purchase on your iPhones. If you're getting this message, you're going to follow these steps to go ahead and fix it. So the very first thing you want to do is simply go into your setting on your Apple account and then tap on your Apple ID up top here and you're going to look at your payment and shipping information. So let's go ahead and tap on that. Now, once in your payment and shipping information, there's a couple of things you want to verify is that if you recently got a new card on file, maybe your previous card expired, you want to update that card that you have on your account. Along with that is the billing address. You want to make sure that billing address is correct, especially if you moved or changed your billing address on that card that you have. You want to make sure it is updated. And that's going to be the important step is because usually there's a problem with the payment uh, method. You might be saying, all right, I'm only using free apps. Why do I need this? It's just the requirement for Apple is that you need a payment on file exact the way they have made it. So you're going to go ahead and update your card if expired or update the numbers and your billing address if it needs to be updated. So that's going to be the first step on troubleshooting. Now, once you updated that, go back to again your Apple account here in the main thing. And this time you're going to look at subscriptions here right? If there's subscriptions here, you want to make sure that if there is any pending or subscriptions that need to be paid, you want to tap to pay it after you update your payment. Because if there is a pending or a subscription that you're not paying because your card expired, it's going to put a hold on your account. So we need to clear that up. And you're going to see a red line of any of the subscription that needs to be paid. Or you can alternately always cancel a subscription or payment that you don't want for it. Now, after you have done that, the next thing you're going to want to do in troubleshooting is go into the App Store itself and then tap on your profile here. And the same exact thing here, you're going to look at your basically purchase history and see if you made a payment or if there's any payment that are pending in this history that you need to be uh, paid. So you want to check that out. Any app that needs to be paid should also come up with a pop up message. You can always tap on your account here and then if there's again a payment issue you can go ahead and update it here and any subscription you need to update it as well here and make sure your country and region is on the right settings now after you have done this and you're still not working the final thing to do sometimes you have to contact apple customer service in order to do that you can google search contact apple support and still take you to support.apple.com and if you go over there there's a billing and subscription support ticket which you can go ahead and contact them with their either the the support store app or your basically managed payment here and that's going to help you figure out exactly what's going on so that's how you can fix the billing issue on your iphone i hope this video was helpful if so please consider the like and subscribe button for more tips and tricks we'll see you guys next time